Hey team, it's Daniel again of the Brazos Valley Boards and Farmers. So, we're doing it. Oh, I got it! I'm so excited! Alright, so, uh, first unboxing video ever. Obviously, I'm very excited. Bear with me on the layout here, because I don't have a studio yet. It's ridiculous looking, but this, this is what I got to work with, and we're doing this. Very first unboxing video, iRay Infrared USA RS75, the very first 1280 thermal scope. Yes, 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 yes. I'm excited. Let's do this. All right, so top-down camera. Um, let's see. Now, guys, I paid all my own money for this. Um, I have been heavily anticipating this, and I have not opened this yet. Let's see what's inside. Stuff that's going to get burned and ruin the environment. <sighs> So exciting. Let's do it here. Oh, guys. Look at this. All right, done with that box. Good. F75 1.0 objective lens, one inch OLED display. That's kind of, that's big. Um, 1280 by 1024, 12 um, sensor resolution, Ricoh RS75. I'm excited. Again, made by iRay, uh, Info. Oh, look at that display. The It's a 2560. OLED display. That's really, really high resolution display. <sighs> Expandable laser ranging function. Microphone. Love it, love it, love it. App compatible. <clears throat> okay. I know like there's a there's a there's like a pelican style case inside. And nothing else in that box. <laughs> wow, this is legit. So, inside, we have the owner's manual. Let's take a gander at it. Okay, table of contents, blah, blah, blah. Don't know what just slid out. A warranty card, tech specs. Those are going to be highly impressive technical specs. The controls, the functions. The, I don't care what's going on in there. I want to play with this thing. Um, okay, so I bought this from Paul Tyson over at Gear the Hunt. So he threw this in there for me. Thank you very much, Paul. Here we are. I gotta go for it, the big enchilada. RS75. I think I can see the future. So you can see here, he's got a five to infinity movable handle. That's gonna be my objective focus. It's gonna be a rail, that's gonna be where the um, LRF attaches on, USB plug-in port, it's going to be USB-C, bottom is where we're going to mount the actual railing, or mount onto a, a rifle, the HB1 battery comes with this one, plus a spare, 
and then there are four button layout again the middle one you can see is raised up that's gonna be my menu and then there's a ridge in between the forward and the very front one so that way you can really get some some actual definition on which buttons you're pushing super exciting eyepiece god this thing is exciting okay like i said uh spare battery uh, let's get through this unboxing cradle for the battery oh my gosh this is going to be a plug yep uh, plug here comes heated target for zero or a heated target for zeroing yeah so these are heated targets so you can zero using these Ooh, the user manual on the LRF the LRF quick attach detach for on the side here for the railing that goes on the side and then the USB for the actual um, LRF to plug into so so it's fully integrated you can choose to have it on there. You can choose to not have it on there. That's a really cool feature that nobody else is doing. That's what IRA does. It's stuff that nobody else is doing. Way to go. Uh, tissue cloth to clean the lens. What's in here? What is this? I have no idea what that is. Not a clue what that dude is. But... Um, I know that the the mount is weird and different, so maybe it has something to do with that. I don't know yet. Definitely going to read that owner's manual before I just, like, start redneck throwing stuff on there like I was trained to do. That other bag that came with it. Oh, that other baggie has got the mounting um, screws back in its spot. All right, here is the cord to use to plug in. Pull all your videos off of it. <clears throat> and then we've got... Oh, this is kind of tough. This is the mount that you use. I was told that the way this works is you can see there's like some spring action going on in there. And you have to use this rail... You know, like we're gonna we're gonna put this thing um, through through the paces like I would any scope, um, and see how it turns out. I'm not gonna be unnecessarily rough with it, but we're gonna be using it how we would use thermal scopes for going after hogs in the middle of the night in rough terrain in Texas. So we'll give this a go. See how that turns out. I, I, I'm happy with it though. I'm like I'm. They've made really good product. It's gonna be it's gonna be fine. It's just different, that's all. Okay. What else is in here? What else? I think that's it. Guys, hope y'all enjoyed this unboxing video. I'm excited. I can't decide what gun to put it on. Alright guys, that's it. If you got spare 18,000 to throw on one thermal device, this is probably going to be the one. Um... I'm excited. I'm ready to use it. Let's go kill some stuff. Guys, it's always hog season, especially with this one. All right, bye.